I'm going to do something that I've never done before, and this was inspired by 235 Chuck. You said something about getting even or the three strikes and you're out. You also claim you're not a Christian or fully a Christian because of your belief in that. Well, I said I believe in God, but I'm not a Christian. This may upset some, but at the same time, thank you for your honesty. Hopefully I don't get on your shit list. <laughs> so I was wondering if you would consider doing a vid or affordable product, they thought out and planned one on handling problem people, getting even, defending one's reputation, when to walk, when to fight, how to afford bullshit, etc. Just a thought, I have many. Following your YouTube channel causes me to come up with stuff. Thanks, Chuck. All right, Chuck, this one's for you. I'm going to create a course. However, there's a catch. See, I tell you up front there's a catch. You don't find it out later. And this is the catch. I'm going to price this course at $49.99. So this is the deal. If 30 people sign up for this course in the next few days, I'll do it Thursday. The day is Monday. Yeah, I'll do it Thursday because I move some other stuff back to next week. So I have time. 30 people sign up for this course. $49.99. I'll make it happen. And y'all can all thank Chuck. What will be in this course? I will teach you. And once again. Some people have a problem with this, but I really don't fucking care. When you do something to me and I didn't do shit to you, I'm going to get your ass. A lot of people don't like that. Don't really care. So the first part of the course will be how to decide on what type of slight is worth revenge. Most of the things that happen in life are not worth fighting over or pursuing anyone. This should be reserved for something extremely heinous, like someone raped your sister. OK, you and the boys go get him and beat the fuck out of him and castrate him. OK, I'm not advising that you do that just to be clear because someone's like, hey, Glendon said, no, don't No, I'm just using that as an example of something that is heinous. That to me is worthy of revenge. You could go to jail if you're caught. Just saying. Now, how I conduct my revenge is what I call safe haven revenge. I don't do shit that will get me put in jail or make me lose my freedom or potentially get me shot. Well, potentially some of the stuff I've done, if they got angry enough, that could happen. So the first thing is, what is worth getting revenge? The guy that cut you off in traffic? No. The girl that cheated on you? Hmm. Kind of depends on how far it went. So you have to develop a philosophy for yourself handling pr problem people that's easy getting even defending one's reputation in today's world that is a slippery slope because someone can just say you did something that runs around the internet and it's believed to be true whether it's true or not so i wouldn't worry so much about defending it i would worry more about living a life that is authentic so that's the type of stuff that'll be in this course i have all day thursday free so that's why i know i can do it and i'll put it together so once again chuck 235 chuck between now and wednesday 30 people need to sign up for this course i'll put the link under the video and we'll see what happens and if anyone else has an idea for a course just put it in the comment section and you'll get the same offer. How cool is that? All right, this is Glendon. I'll see you in the next session. And Chuck, thanks for the emails. Mails, plural. I got a bunch of them, but I thought this one was fun.